Hey guys, it's Mace here. Uh, we're in Car Mechanic Simulator 2015. It's been a while since I've put out a video for this. I've got $137,000 and 15,000 XP. Why not go out to the auction center and build our primary objective on else's car you know what I mean but when we buy this car we're gonna redo the entire engine I don't want that car I want something with like this I could go for this but I don't want this one either I ain't picky. I know. This I could go for. We'll make a bid on this. Just let me buy the car already, please. Come on, any day now. Got it. Move it to the garage, let's go quit. We have $89,000. I'm sorry. Sending a text to my aunt. Re redoing this entire thing. And I do not like anything on it. Let's move it over to lifter one. Ha. Damn throttle. Let's get you out. There we go. And when I mean we're doing everything, I mean we're doing everything. We're taking the entire engine out. We're putting in a new trans. We're redoing all the running gear. Everything you can do in this thing, we're doing it. Because I have money to blow. I have 89,000 left. We can surely do this. Come on. Get out. Ah, uh, that's right. Gotta take out these... Ignition coils. And last bolt. Get you out. Then get these spark plugs out. Radiator, radiator fan, and get this belt tensioner off. Or, sorry. Uh, 
belt tensioners right there. It was an idle roller. Get the serpentine belt off. And the rest. I get the water pump. That's off, get the timing cover off. Get these cam timing belts, cam gears, and then we can get the cam shafts. That might be helpful if we want to get <coughs> <coughs> sorry about that if we want to get this engine head off oh I just upgraded to 15609 talking about it goes up little by little all right if we want to get that stuff off let's take out the battery What are your guys' thoughts on the developers trying to release a uh, key map configurations? And when they're thinking about releasing the Turbo DLC, that I'd like to see very soon I don't even care if all the oil drips out on the floor let's take you out you Lower this puppy. Take out these pistons. And then while we're under the car this time, we can take out that trans and the drive shaft because we'll need to take out that before we can remove the crankshaft as you can see so let's go ahead and get down to this okay let's get back here take out the starter your box and 
find that is out. car get this engine block out and voila it is out now we can go ahead and start on this running gear That's gotta be access under the car. Of course, it would be. Why didn't I just keep it lifted? Well, that's right, to get that engine block out. Get you out. Left side is done. Sometimes I forget what I'm supposed to do, but don't we all? I think I just move too fast at a fast pace, you know? I didn't even take the brakes off. How genius of me. That is out. Now we can start on the rear. We almost have it. And then we could put it back all together. I might actually I don't remember what I'm gonna say 
I feel a little bit of stupid. And a whole lot of dumb. If that makes sense. One more thing, and then we can... Two more things, and then we can take out that side. Let's go ahead and take out this. We got that side out, and now we have that out. Well, guys, the deconstruction is now complete. What I will do is, if you guys enjoyed this episode of deconstruction, this car, please go ahead and leave a like and comment. And subscribe make sure you keep a lookout for episode number two of the reconstruction <laughs>